Hi guys, welcome to your week ahead. Let's see what we have. Oh, just to share with you, um, Venus has gone out of retrograde, so we still should see, be seeing some negative effects until about October 7th, but if you've been having problems with relationships or finances, that should start to clear up a little bit for you. <laughs> Thank goodness, right? All right, let's see what we got. All 12 signs, right? A Capricorn, Justice. Okay, so it could have something to do with the Libra or you could be wanting to be treated more fairly in a certain situation or feeling like you, you haven't been fair to others, wanting to rectify that. Aquarius, you have either invested some time and effort into something and you're waiting to see it's the fruits of your labor or you're kind of just keeping an eye on the situation and watching to see how it turns out. Pisces. Knight of Wands. Okay, so you could be somebody who's kind of in and out of a relationship or you could be involved with somebody like this. Um, sometimes this is kind of um, somebody who's playing the field or dating around or seeing a lot of people. So you or somebody you're involved with could be on this uh, Playboy energy this week. Aries, Five of Swords. You're feeling very defeated about something. Um, you gave something your best effort and you're feeling... Um, defeated. It didn't work out the way you had hoped it would. Taurus, the Ten of Wands. You got the world, the weight of the world on your shoulders this week, Taurus. Um, it's like a lot of stress, a lot of tension, all up in your head, maybe. Gemini, oh no. <laughs> the Three of Swords. That could be a third party situation. Somebody could have somebody on the side. Um, it's a heartbreak, definitely, for sure. So, um, I wish I had better news for you, Gemini. All right, Cancer. We got the Four of Cups. You're bored with your relationship or you're bored with your emotions. You're bored. Something to do with your um, emotional interest. Um, so either you're very bored with the situation or you're not interested anymore. Leo. Ready to take action on something. Um, communication, thoughts, creativity, ideas, you're ready to take action on whatever you've been planning. Virgo, feeling pretty good, but something's missing. Feeling like there's a missing component somewhere. Libra, feeling a little guarded. Um, could also be watching your finances right now, um, being kind of uh, frugal. Um, like I just said, the uh, Venus retrograde is ending, so that should clear it for you. Libra, Scorpio, Wheel of Fortune, good things coming your way. I know that I was hit. I'm Scorpio. I know I was hit very strongly with this Venus retrograde, so hopefully with that leaving, things are coming back around for us, Scorpios. Sagittarius, you have got the Queen of Wands, so you're not taking any crap from anybody. You're cutting out nonsense. You're cutting out things in your life that don't serve you or um, are not helpful to you in some way. Okay, so that's kind of like doing some spring cleaning in your life. That's what I have for you guys this week. I hope that you liked that. I hope that resonated with you. Please subscribe to my channel. Head over to YouTube. It's Scorpio Cat Tarot. And I hope you guys have a great week ahead, and I will see you next time.